I've had back problems for about 20 years. Um, it's a hereditary thing. Her fault. And, <laughs> no, it's not her fault. Um, it's, it just runs in the family, which has mm. got a, a sort of slightly altered spine, I suppose you'd say. Yeah. So my nan, my mum, my aunt, and now me, we've all got it. Well, for me, I've had, same as Vicky, I've had, I even, at 25, had a back operation. Um, I like the fusion of spine. But, and it was good, it worked, because I played netball and all sorts of things. But then, just life in general starts taking its toll on just general wear and tear, I suppose. Um, but then, when I started, Vicky said to me, you must come, you must come. So I started to come, and, and it was great, and it was maintaining, it was great. And then, last month, um, I was in a car accident. So I've had to be coming like two or three times a week, but it has helped. It has helped greatly. It's helped me move because I sort of suffered whiplash, and without Tom's help, I probably would be almost totally immobile. I think generally, when you hear about someone getting their bones clipped, it's, it's sort of like a comedy routine, isn't it? You sort yeah. of you you see the things out of the the TV shows where people get clipped and cracked and they end up, you know, like. But it's not that at all, you know you almost anticipate that there's going to be pain and noise and some kind of background laughter track but it's no it's not like that at all it's very gentle and it, it's a bit weird that something so not, not simple but something that doesn't seem to have a huge impact on you during a treatment can actually impact your life in such a huge way and that's why it's absolutely ideal i think they, they really help because they explain to you they show you on the x-ray where things are wrong and they, and Tom actually explains, even at weekly, when it, well, or monthly when you come, he actually explains what's wrong where and puts it right. Mm. Yeah, and then it's that, yeah, and how then our body has to try and adjust to that fix. And Tom and the chiropractors can do things that a physio doesn't do. A physio will get you to move your arms, legs and back and bend and whatever, whereas Tom sort of clicks you back into place and tells you that the reason this is happening is because your pelvis is out of line and because this is wrong and that's wrong, which is good because a physio doesn't do that. You don't feel like, oh God, I've got to go to the doctor or I've got to go to the chiropractor or whatever. They're so nice and so friendly and, and extremely professional. Yeah. yeah, lovely. I can pick my little one up without having to yeah, worry yeah. and you know, I can pick her up and swing her around and, and muck around with her and I can take her to the playground. She's got someone who can do more for her and with her than I could before. That's and that's good. what's important to me. It's not a quick fix. I mean, it is in a sense of the word in that you can have a treatment and you will feel miles better straight away. But it's one of those things where if you've got the sort of condition that does need tending to a lot, like I have, then yeah, it's definitely a way of life and it's a way of improving your life. Mm, definitely.